In order to activate the payload feature, press the lower left app button, then select payload. There is no target payload set, so press the lower right menu button, select target payload, and enter a numerical weight, like 15 tons for example, and hit apply. Then turn on weight mode to enable it and return to the home screen. Here at the payload main screen, the 15 ton target payload is in the middle. There is zero in the truck and nothing in the bucket. After the bucket is filled and raised out of a hole with material, the weight is confirmed with a green light and an audible sound. As the bucket is emptied into the truck, the weight of the material is transferred into the truck and the target payload is lowered by the same amount. On the next load of the bucket, the weight is measured again. This time, it is confirmed at 2.28 tons and transferred to the weight of the truck. With each pass, the number of passes is noted in the monitor as well as number of trucks. As the target weight of the truck gets close, the machine will calculate how many tons are needed to complete the payload. If the final bucket load will overfill the target weight, the machine will sound an audible alarm and the target will turn red. In this case, the operator needs to tip off some of the extra material to keep within the target payload. With the weight of the bucket confirmed and transferred to truck, the payload indicator turns green when within 0.5 tons of the target. After target payload is reached, the machine shows 14.6 tons are in the truck without being overloaded.